to do. Great, dear. You're damn right you don't. I don't need a rundown on her reputation. If Mary works out of there, I need to look into it. Yeah. I just wanted to provide for beauty. Give her the kind of life she deserves. Well, we shouldn't have to live like this. I'm scraping to get by. None of us should. We were royal. The unfortunate of we were accustomed to a certain lifestyle. The way life goes. All we want is to make this place feel a little bit like home. You wouldn't understand, Big B. No. Probably not. Yeah, he was a big bad wolf. So, where are you? The going? Other world. If this all goes sideways. Living in a like part small apartment is a step up. That's what Donald Trump would go for go through if he ever lost all of his fortune. Mm. Very interesting. Very interesting. What's your shop? I'm going to the Lucky Pond. There's too much going on there to ignore. I'll have a word or two with Jersey. You know, Bigby, once you show your face there, word is going to get out. There may be nothing left to Let's see. Let's go back to see what the, uh... Well, I guess I'll find out. Plate. We'll go lead to for another time. We have time afterwards. Wait, I don't know what you're Episode 5. To you find Crooked Man, but is there any way you could help us out? What do you mean? Well, maybe you can make this all just go away. We would really appreciate it. Well, if the guy, if, the, if he is. Can you help us out? I'll handle it. I'm not going to let that crooked bastard ruin any more lives. Oh, the fact of it is, if he's behind the murders, if he's behind sure everything we're the right going on, I'm sure. I'm sure. It's, you don't have any more to deal with right when this is all done. The good man. Dirty. No, it's not. It looks like you slept in Hello, a Jack. pile of garbage. Jack, why are you... I've seen you take a torn purse for a tenner. Yeah, but I also got her phone number. I don't want <laughs> her phone number. Ugh, really? That could be people would want Mr. Toad's phone number. Bigby's here. Uh, why are you never glamoured, Toad? Why is it so hard to just... Follow the rules. Look, I know some fables can switch from man to beast and back again, like changing shirts. But it's not so easy for the rest of us to look human, all right? And anyways, I'm getting the money right now. I'm not taking the coat. But it's magic. So? And it'd be covering a check I already wrote. Okay, well, that sounds like a your problem problem to me. Yeah, it is. And so I came here to sell it off. Why would you think I'd take an ugly used mule skin coat? Hey, wait a minute. That's Faith's coat. It yeah. was Faith's coat. Look, you left it in my place. What do you expect me to do? Yes, Good I point. think the off-sighted statute of Finder's Keepers clearly states that it's his now, Bigby. So what's it gonna be? Just I don't take know the coat, point. Jack. See if Cindy needs a coat. I don't know. <sighs> this is to pay for those bloody glamours, you know. You and your blinkered rules. If a witches didn't charge so fucking much, I wouldn't have to be in here dealing with this nonsense. You know, maybe Snow can help you out. How could Snow help me out? Give you an advance. A loan or something. She's kind of in charge of the business office now. 
Well, the last guy who was in charge did no press match, so forgive me if I don't expect anything different now. Yeah, but still, not the last guy. The last about. guy was an ass. Shouldn't be that big of a shock that I'm not gonna take an ass hair coat. No, I guess it should be. <laughs> <laughs> I like that one, Dick. Just gonna set up for one of his shady fucking loans. Ixnay on the own lays, okay, Ogfrey? I mean, what kind of a game are you running here? Toad? You turn down people's stuff so you can peddle his shit? I know who you're talking about. Um, Ogfrey? The crooked no, guy, uh, right? Frank. This is his the place. Crooked Frey. Those are his lawns. Well, I'll leave you to your business. I'm sure you'll have a lot to talk about. Good luck with that glamour, Toad. Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> How the hell do you expect me to get a glamour, then? It's not like I've got a lot of options, you know. Look, I'll... I'll give you some money, all right? You've got to be kidding me. Do you even know how much a glamour costs? I've... I've never had to buy one. Keep your money, Sheriff. I've no patience for charity. That charity is being nice, like guys. Can't you at least wear a bigger hat? You know, it's getting old to tell the difference. Between what? Between the business office and fables like a crooked man. Who you purportedly seek to protect us from. Either way, I'm getting screwed. Oh, Drop man. by any time. Look, I'm sorry, alright? What else do you want from me? He really grows on you. Like a wart. Look, I told you I work here, and I do, okay? So don't look so surprised. And before you ask, I've never seen the crooked man in here. Neither hide nor hair and all that. In fact, as far as I can tell, oh, he doesn't have to from what I've heard. heard. Bloody Mary works for him. And the last time I saw her, she had the woodsman's axe. So? So the last time anybody else saw that axe, it was here. We'd never take something like that. You wouldn't? Is this really why you came down here? The woodsman's axe? That and Beauty's loan she took out. And the crooked she man. told you about that. Yep. And now you're going to tell me about it. Look, people get desperate, and when you're drowning, anything that isn't sinking along with you looks like a life raft. So the you threaten them? And he wants things in return. <clears throat> and when you don't pay up, bad stuff happens. Why do you think I've never taken one? A little credit card fraud never hurt anybody. I should know. Bad stuff. You mean he kills them? Or worse. Simple Simon tried to open up a bakery, took out a loan to help with the expense, but when he started getting laid on the payments, the crooked man put him into one of the pies and served it to a litter of alley Oh, God. At least, that's what I heard. Oh. Oh, my God. Listen, I gotta start closing up shop, so, uh... Close? It's the middle of the day. What can yeah. I say? Jersey likes to run at odd hours. And really, he'd be the one to talk to, so can't you just swing by later? It really wouldn't be good for me if he sees your face when he walks in. So what? Uh, I still think you're hiding something, Jack. Maybe you the axe is Jack. back here. It's not. It was bad enough in the woodsman's hands. And if it's not here, I need to track down that psycho who had it last. It's not here. You better hope not. Can't you Shut just... up, Jack. If the Jersey Devil yeah. isn't here to answer my questions, it also means he isn't here to get in my way. So I'm gonna take a look around, as long as I've got the elbow room. All right. Don't let me get in your way. I won't. Hmm. Just my luck. Reminds me of Briar Rose. You're not touching anything, are you? He's just looking, Jack. Oh, okay, then. Even if he was, it must have been spying a lass. Hey, look with your eyes, not your hands, okay? Now 
next to a fish and a deer. If it was ten years old, I'd probably be talking. Singing. Uh, ho, ho, ho. You Cut! Something like Almost right-handed. Uh, uh, what? I, I, do, I don't, uh... You're a lying piece of shit, Jack. Oh, okay, come on, Bigby. That wasn't... Jack's was right here all along. Now tell me what happened to it. I don't know anything about that. I don't. Jack. I Jack mean, will point dead, you. So... Oh, oh, what happened to the axe? Okay, okay. Fucking jeez, take it easy. It was Mary. She took it, okay? That's all I know. That's all you know? You don't know she almost fucking killed me with it last night? No. No. I had no goddamn idea. She sometimes comes in to pick up shit. She say anything about... About the crooked man's plans. About Crane? What? Oh, we know friends? Crane's those uh, I money. I try not to even look that crazy chick in the eye. Well, for your sake, you better think of something to tell me. That's all I can yeah. tell you. I'm being straight here. I'm just part-time. I mean, it's Jersey who's the one who's into this stuff. He's one of the crooked man's boys, okay? And it'd be great if he was here to tell you all this, but he's not. So just... Jersey, don't... Don't give me that shit. What the fuck is the point of having a system if you're... Oh... But you... You're the guy who makes sure I'm the guy to keep shit in order, and that's it, Woody. Who closed the fucking gate? Jack? If you love your Jersey so Devil. Much, why'd you pawn it in the first place? Well, glamour. I didn't pawn it, asshole. It was stolen from my apartment. And Grant said that he's... Now tell me where it is right fucking now. Woody, Relax, Woody. Down. Your axe isn't here. Christ. And this fucking guy, too? Bigby. What? It isn't? Nope. It isn't. Oh, play Mary stole. Just like I said, it's it? not here. Happy? And you. I can't believe you'd even show your face in here. After what you did, I can't believe you're even you in, it, in there with this bad accent. Or get the fuck out. Uh, he wanted to know where... Actually, you know what? I don't care what he wanted. If I were you, I'd watch my tone about now. Uh, how's your arm? Bloody Mary leaves a bit of a stink, don't she? Jack. Did you know that as a be careful, you'd be the one stinging. He's joined the crooked man's obedience school for wayward fucking creatures. He's already passed his first class. You see, the sheriff had who he stupidly thought was the murderer been chasing him for fucking days, right? But the crooked man snapped his bony fingers and Bigby handed him over just like uh, that. No. I'm uh, just gonna uh, let you two. Jersey, yeah. you are this Fuck close from getting Jersey. your nose broken. Just like rain. Even worse. It's Woodsy just found out your is where his axe was. Are you kidding me? It was here. It was right fucking here. What did you do with it? How the fuck do I know? Listen, you bald little dipshit. You're gonna <clears throat> You piece of shit. Told ya. I'm gonna rip your fucking lungs out. I'd like to see you try you backwards, fuck. Back it up, Jersey. You're dealing with me now. I didn't expect mm -hmm. to see you upright. Still looking for whoever killed them hookers? Or are you done chasing your tail? Where's my axe? Who'd you give it to? Ooh. <laughs> That's it? You talk big. But I don't think you got the stones to back it up. Still Ooh. a little sore, are we? Why should Mary get all the fun? You ain't so tough. Oh, yeah. This ain't gonna go like... Ah! You Ooh. fucking... <laughs> yeah. Oh. What the hell are you doing? This is my fucking fight. Not now, dog. We can work nerve. together. Let's beat the crap out of them. 
Are you gonna work as a team? Oh. 